Hey guys, Matthew Wolf here with the new Stealth Plus driver. Um, just gonna give you a little tip on how to get the most out of your driver that you're playing and how to hit the ball the farthest and the straightest. First and foremost for me, you know, the biggest thing on hitting a driver is making sure to hit up on it. I think that there's too many people that hit too far down on it and you know not only hitting down on it not only does that make the ball spin more and go more up in the air but it also you know it's just way harder to control the club face at that point so for me i always like to hit up on the ball not only is that going to allow you to hit it straighter and control your face a little better but it's also going to help you decrease the spin a little bit which will in result make you hit the ball farther so uh, hitting up on the ball is definitely a good way to decrease the spin and also make the ball launch higher, which is all stuff for making the ball go farther. But I think the biggest thing for me and the most important thing in my swing is rotation. So when you're hitting a golf ball, it's the same thing with like throwing a, throwing a baseball. I mean, you don't throw a baseball like that. You throw a baseball and you open up and you turn and you throw the ball. It's the same thing with the driver. So many people hit down on the ball and they get so stuck and they don't turn through the ball. I mean, you see all the, far, the, the guys who hit the ball the furthest, you know, Dustin Johnson, me, Rory. I mean, there's so many other guys out there that, that hit the ball so far, but you see them fly open and it's controlled. It's not out of control spinning out, but you really have to make sure to open up that chest and open up those hips and in order, it's like a coil. You know, you, you wind a coil up and as soon as you release that coil, it just springs open really fast. Whereas if you just lift your arms up, and don't turn, it's all from your arms. I'll show you one, especially how I hit it. I like to you know, be, on a, be in an athletic position at my setup, make sure to just keep that knee bend, you know, good balance in the balls of your feet. And then from there, like I said, just rotate and hit up on the ball. Yeah, so I mean, I think the biggest thing, you know, that one, you know, it is blowing about 25 miles an hour into the wind right now. So it definitely got up in the air, but the spin was still down on it and it was a pretty consistent ball flight. But I think at the end of the day, those are just three things that you need to focus on is making sure to hit up on the ball, maybe more just not hit down on the ball, keep on rotating through the ball. And from there, just using the ground and, you know, making sure that you're not hitting down on the ball or, or stopping your body. You need to continue to accelerate through the ball and that'll give you the most distance and help you get the most out of your driver.